Barbara Billingsley played TV mother June Cleaver on the classic television show Leave It to Beaver for six seasons. And during that time, June and her husband Ward, played by the great Hugh Beaumont, did their very best to help sons Wally and Theodore, also known as the Beaver, to make good choices as they marched down the path towards manhood. During the show's six seasons, one on CBS and the remaining five on ABC, the cast became incredibly close-knit. Although the boys never forgot that they already had parents, both Jerry Mathers and Tony Dow acknowledged the substantive role that Barbara had in real life during their formative years. Sure, it was all make-believe, and yes, they were all actors, just reading lines off of a script, but behind the scenes, Barbara had a lasting impact on everyone that she worked with. In addition to her TV sons, both Ken Osmond, who played Eddie Haskell, and Frank Bank, who played Lumpy Rutherford, have tipped their hats to this special lady. So with that said, I'm going to let these four actors count down the top five reasons why Barbara Billingsley was the greatest TV mom ever. So let's start with Tony. On more than one occasion, he has talked about how Barbara was a great collaborator. What does that mean? Well, both on screen and off, Barbara was generous to a fault with her fellow cast members. It was important to her that each actor give their best performance, and she would frequently partner with her co-stars to determine how a scene might best play out. This trait was so endearing that later on in the 80s, when Barbara was feeling a little down herself, Tony looked for an opportunity for Barbara and himself to work together again. In this specific case, it was the play Come Blow Your Horn, where Barbara and Tony would once again play mother and son. Next up is Lumpy. Oops, I mean Frank Bank. Frank has talked about how Barbara kept all of the boys in line on the show. She wasn't so much a disciplinarian, but rather a kind and caring adult figure who wanted to help these rambunctious young men stay out of trouble. According to Frank, the opportunities for Barbara to swiftly and subtly save the day came often during the Leave it to Beaver years. And while from time to time the boys resented Barbara when she inserted herself into a specific situation, they also understood that it was because she cared. Moving on to Ken Osmond, it's worth noting, by the way, that all of these comments from Barbara's younger cast members come from an event where Barbara was receiving recognition posthumously by the motion picture and television industry. They were recognizing her significant contributions to the industry and they were doing it at least partially due to the efforts of Frank, Ken, Tony, and Jerry. Yep, she was beloved. And on that evening, Ken summed up his thoughts with one word. He described Barbara as gracious. He then told the audience, which also included Barbara's real family, how much he loved her, and then quietly returned to his seat. Finally, it was Jerry Mather's turn. Jerry called Barbara a great teacher and shared a story about a time when Barbara had taught him to be a gentleman and about how one should always respect a lady. Just like Tony, Jerry acknowledged his own parents and how great they were. Clearly, neither of Barbara's TV sons wanted their own parents to feel slighted, but they also wanted Barbara's family to understand just how truly impactful she had been, how wonderful and important the time that they had spent on set together with her was for both of them. Heck, what am I saying? All four of them. All right, so that's four reasons. Let me add a fifth reason, which is this. Despite all of Wally and the Beaver's shenanigans, Barbara played her character June Cleaver with such joy and confidence that even as a young man, I understood from her example, as well as Hugh Beaumont's, what it meant to be a parent. The good, the bad, the sometimes hilarious moments that come from being part of a family. It helped me to value my own family more, and it made me want to be a father someday. Not right at that moment. Heck, I was just a kid. But someday, I knew I wanted to have a family of my own. So that's my five reasons. Speaking of hilarity, how can I put together a video talking about Barbara Billingsley where I don't mention her awesome cameo in the movie Airplane? I still chuckle every time I think about the Beaver's mom talking jive. It's also quite fitting that her final feature film was 1997's Leave It to Beaver movie. While obviously too old to play June Cleaver, Barbara's cameo as the Beaver's aunt was perfect in a great way 
to close out her motion picture career. All right, one more picture. I wonder what Ward is saying to June in this scene. Truthfully, she looks a little concerned. Was it something about the beaver? Maybe he and his best friend Larry had gotten into trouble again. Okay, now it's your turn. Were you a fan of the show, and more specifically Barbara? Leave your memories in the comments section below. If you enjoyed this video, please click on the like button and share with your friends and family on Facebook and Twitter. And while you're at it, why not subscribe to my little channel? I talk about music, movies, and television mostly from the 60s, 70s, and 80s. You know, the good stuff. But most importantly, and as always, thank you so much for watching.